brothers and sisters, to all the Christians out there and even the secular people too, this is the perfect time for homeschooling. This is the perfect time to start looking at that because you couldn't ask for a better time. I know that sounds strange to say that, but this is a perfect opportunity to see how you are blinded by the public school system. Teachers out there, you're going to get mad at me, but you know as well as I do that you can't even be as good of a teacher as you would like to be because of the restrictions of the government, and your local school boards. You have, let's say, 25 kids in a room, right? 25 kids. You got 20 different personalities. You got seven IEPs, eight 504 plans. Not putting a child down here. I'm not saying that at all. Not saying that at all. Please don't uh, misinterpret this because in society, that's what we like to do. We like to pick up the things and then attack that. This is the perfect time to homeschool. Our two youngest ones are homeschooled. My oldest one, unfortunately, right now is in high school. We are actually working on trying to get him out of there because I would rather see him online learning, which is kind of humorous because now what are they doing right now? Online learning. So we know it works. They call it distance learning in my area, but they're using online material. So we know that it can be done. We know for a fact that it can be done. So do it. Though I understand there are some parents who aren't going to be able to pull this off. I'll tell you what I did when my son was younger. And I didn't want to put him in a daycare. So I completely changed my shift. I went to second shift when she worked the first shift. That was a long time ago in my first marriage. I've said that I, 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 I'm, not, I'm not married to that person. I am divorced. Go ahead and, and make your comments if you will. Because I'll flip that back and explain to you how it's biblical. Because... The only way God allows it is adultery. And that's the reason I am divorced, because of her adultery. I don't usually like to want to throw that out there, but that's the case. Anyways, so here's the deal. I took a second shift job, first shift job. We made it work. Now, you can do the same thing or try. Do the best that you can. You will be much happier knowing that you have full control over your child and your child's future because let's face it you know there are some people out there going my child doesn't get enough they're not helping or you get my child doesn't get enough because uh he's way ahead and now he's got to stop or she's got to stop in the in learning process so everybody else can catch up that's not an insult to other kids i'm just saying if you had your kids homeschooled you have more control who better to indoctrinate your children than you not the system, but you. Now, I hate to say use the word indoctrination, but that's what the school system is. Everyone knows it. A lot of people know that. But they're forced into a situation they have no, no choice but to endure that because they can't do anything else. And your daycares, well, you can't control that either because you're at home. I mean, I'm sorry, not home, but at work. You can't control that, that atmosphere either. Because that's what the government has been wanting since the 70s. They've been doing this for a long time. Cause both parents to work instead of one. Mm -hmm. So you're not there for your... So you have more latchkey kids. Remember that term? Oh, I'm a little older, so I, I remember that term latchkey kid when I was growing up. But that's... I'm a little uh, older. I don't know how that long that term has been out there. And another thing... I'm going to go ahead and ask people to go ahead and subscribe to my channel. I don't know who's out there, who will be watching this video. Subscribe to my channel. Because, you know, we can have great discussions on a lot of these things. But listen, I'm, I'm, I'm commanding you to listen. Look at that, I'm, you know. But you have to homeschool your children if you can. Make this happen. Make this work. Take the power. Take the power of controlling your children out of the government's hands into your hands your hands because when you pull that give them the power what does that say the government can come back and say hey listen we know better than you really who knows better than a good mother a good father who knows better for those children oh yeah absolutely and even those who bring their children to church and the bible and they read it every day and that, oh that is awesome those of you do but then they go to public school and they wonder about all these other things. And then they get inundated and then inundated. So you're a very small voice in a school system's voice. 
because they're more somewhere else. So please, homeschool. This is the perfect time to discover homeschooling and learning homeschooling. Now, I'm not great at homeschooling. I play principal at, um, excuse me, principal at home. Uh, my wife does the teaching. And she does a fantastic job. She's unbelievable what she does. It's amazing. In fact, we saw the progression that they made at home. They read, they write, they do math. They're a little bit ahead on some of the math. ELA, they're a little bit ahead of their level. Um, reading, they're at their level, maybe slightly higher. And I'm not saying that in any bragging. But I don't want to go too long on this video. I've been making, the last video I made was over seven minutes long. Uh, I think I'm around six at the moment. But this is the perfect time. Especially for Christians. This is the perfect time to discover home learning. If you haven't, but a lot of have. This is the perfect time for even secular people. These are your children. Your children. Take control of your children. Don't let the government take them. Don't let the public school system take them. Because they're indoctrinated. I know teachers. I was in the system for eight years. I know teachers who have left the system. I know some have gone online. They, teach, they started as a, a gig on the side. And then they actually went into it full time. Because it was better. It was just better. That's all there is to it. It's better. Too many restrictions. Too many ways of hampering. And the school system is controlled by what the government wants those kids to know. Instead of what you want them to know. So that's the end of my video. I appreciate you watching, as usual. And as usual, God bless, I love you, and have a fantastic day.